So I've been watching lots of Wisconsin YouTube videos and I thought I'd do one for Milwaukee because you don't find many videos for Milwaukee that I have seen. Some interesting facts and then we will try to look at some pictures of other stuff in Milwaukee. Some interesting facts are that the typewriter was invented in the 1860s by Christopher Latham, Scholes, Carlos Glid Glidden, and Samuel Soule in Milwaukee. Uh, it has the largest music festival in the nation, that's just Summerfest. I was trying to find out how I could look it up. So, this whole area is like the Summerfest. Like this whole entire section here. This is pretty, pretty huge. Uh, Carmex lip balm was invented in Milwaukee in the 1930s by Alfred Wolfings. Uh, Lake Park, no, that's the same as Lakeshore Park, was designed by Frederick. No, that's not sure that's not. By Frederick Law Olmsted, who designed New York's Central Park. Oh, there it is. It's the Lake Park. Well, it's designed by the same guy that did Central Park. Uh, the Holler House is the oldest sanctioned bowling alley in the U.S. It opened in 1908. Holler House. Holla. Let's take a gander. Holler House. So that is Right there, I think it's a two lane, yeah, two lane bowling alley. There's a small lake under the city. Lake Emily is under the old Northwestern Mutual building. Um, it was built on top and was supported by ancient log pilings. Uh, let's see what else we got here. It's got the world's largest dinosaur head. The world's largest T-Rex head at the Milwaukee Public Museum. Okay. Milwaukee Public Museum is right around here. Uh, the art museum wings move. They open in the morning and close at night. I think I could probably find that. Yep. So that's this thing right here. I heard the building was, this part of the building was shaped to resemble a boat. I don't know if that's true or not, but that's what I heard. Uh, the Milwaukee Wave soccer team is the oldest in the U.S. It's been around since 1984. Some Milwaukeean invented the answering machine. It was invented by Jose Joseph Zimmerman and George Danner. Danner. Laverne and Shirley was a classic 1970s sitcom set in Milwaukee. The Pabst Brewery 
was the first brewery in Milwaukee in 1844, and though I read somewhere else, it's 1840. So I don't know which is true. Teddy Roosevelt was shot here, and he survived after being shot in point blank range during his speech, and he finished his speech with the bullet still in him. Uh, Milwaukee was built on swampland. It was originally spelled M I L W A U K I E instead of E E. Jerome Silverman was born in 1933 in Milwaukee, or as you may know him as, Gene Wilder. Heather Graham was born in 1970 in Milwaukee and lived there until she was about nine years old, I believe I read. The Red Arrow Park's ice rink is larger than Times Square's Rockefeller Center's ice rink. I don't honestly know where Red Arrow Park is. <laughs> But still pretty cool. Not sure. We've got a whole bunch of breweries. Okay. Harley Davidson's first motorcycle was obviously built in 1903. And Harley Davidson's obviously from Milwaukee. Uh the U.S. Bank Center is the tallest building in the state. U.S. Bank Center is somewhere close to the park. Somewhere close to the park here. Well, it's somewhere around here. Anyways, that's the tallest building in the state. That's probably why I think it's so close. It's probably farther away than I think it is. Any Hoosier, that is a golden thing to have. Uh, Happy Days set was here, and it's also home to the Bronze Bonds. Uh, Alan Bradley Clock Tower was once tallest four-faced clock in the world until ousted by clock in Saudi Arabia. So, I think the clock is around here somewhere. I'm not really doing a good job of showing you this stuff, aren't I? am I? Okay, anyways, it's around there somewhere. <laughs> Festa Italiana, which is held at the State Fairgrounds, is one of the largest Italian festivals in the U.S. North Point Lights Beacon was tallest on Great Lakes when Lighthouse was built in 1855. Downtown Skywalk, only one in U.S. over a river used by boats. That's got to be an easy one to find it's over the water. Probably won't be though. Probably over here somewhere though. Oh, there's a bronze fonds right there. Okay. Uh, Admiral's hockey team, originally known as Milwaukee Wings. The Milwaukee Curling Club is oldest continually operating curling club in the U.S. Miller Park only has the only fan-shaped convertible roof in the U.S which is now the AmFam Field. It'll always be 
Miller Park to us though. Okay. First brewery uh, opened in 1940, I think that was the Pabst one, uh, known as Brew City because it was home to Pabst, Miller, Blatt's, and Schlitz breweries. Miller still has a headquarters or uh, headquarters there. You know, now it's Miller Coors. I'm sure they do most of their stuff outside of the state. Samson the Gorilla was the most famous resident. He was a famous gorilla at our Milwaukee County Zoo. Uh, apparently Miller Brewing invented light beer. I don't know if that's true or not. We were part of the All-American Girls Professional Baseball League with the Milwaukee Chicks. The National Bobblehead Museum and Hall of Fame is located in Milwaukee. And I'm going to end it there because I have you know, like two pages worth of stuff. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, comment. Let me know and I'll do a second one. And honestly, if you don't like it, I'll probably still do a second one later. Goodbye. Slay a lighter.